Mic test, mic test. Hello everyone and welcome back to another Buddy Bison stream! So today, we are going to be playing some more Bug Fables. Uh, hopefully after, uh, after last stream, where I got a bit salty. Not gonna lie, I got a bit salty when I was fighting the Mother Chomper. Um, it's a bit salty. <laughs> because it took me a lot of tries. Um... Today, Bose, to get this guy. But today, we are going to, um, uh, finally advance the plot a bit. Sky Second Chat, uh, I know that game. Yes, you do. Uh, and I believe, if I remember correctly, I saw that, um, I'm actually gonna go collect some crystal berries, because I actually have a thing opened up. I believe I saw on the, 
uh, Trail Speedrunning Discord, you had put that you were uh, asking about the Patermater fight with Rem. Uh, if, but correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, but, uh, eh. yeah, in the tower. Yeah, I mean, I, of course, uh, as I have stated before, I only have a passing knowledge about various things. Oh, interesting that the thief isn't there anymore. Um, I guess it's because I did the dungeon. Uh, I only have a passing knowledge of second chapter from watching the cutscenes, so, uh, I'm not too... Uh, caught up on all of that, but I will be once I play it. Um, now I will note that uh, if the uh, if the thing gets met, that one will probably be more in like November or uh, November, just because I don't want to have two long trails games back to back, even if they are uh, separated by East potentially. Uh, but that was one, and then. Okay, let me go back to the main area. Yeah, because I need to collect some of these crystal berries um, so I can buy cool stuff. I found something weird when I finished the game. Having the skip movies setting on does not skip the credits. Oh, interesting. I guess it. I guess it doesn't technically count as a uh, as a um, a movie then. Um, heard. I feel like I. Is it like. Is it like back here? Uh... Oh, wait. Right here? No, that's a black cherry. So there's just a black skirt. The movie, uh, movie of the credits is removed, but the music plays in its entirely. Okay, so the music still goes. That's. That's an odd distinction. Um, okay, let me come over here. Like I have it. Um, in, in, like the night area. Big spot on top of a rock to the right of the Explorers Association. Oh, this. Okay, here we go. There we go. Give me that crystal berry. This is the fun and annoying part of hidden secret currencies. <laughs> uh, very. But this is the beautiful part about playing a game that was released in 2019 and 2021. Almost 2022, basically. Uh, because now there's guides for everything. There we go. That's cool. I like that. Um, okay, got that one, got that one, behind the dock, access that, there, in the windmill, yep, got that one, devour one, got that one, got that one, defeated, got that one, 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 right at the end, got that one, okay. So, I'm literally just going down the list for ones that I can get now, uh, and potentially quickly. Uh, I need to go down to the mines, and then I need to go to the workroom, but hey, how's it going? Team Stankmouth, I can bet. I don't need to go to Ant City Plaza. Um, okay. Come over here. Workroom. Go to the mound right here. Boom. Give me that berry. How many berries? I now have ten. That's pretty good. <laughs> See, kids, this is why you shouldn't feel ashamed looking up guides. Because, you know, sometimes the game doesn't want you to do it quickly. Uh, sometimes they want you to remember where every small little bump and crack is. But you know what? We don't have time for that. Uh, okay, so Golden Settlement. There are a couple there, so let's head over there. I don't know. Oh, okay, these aren't, like, save things. Let's go to Golden Settlement. Okay. Believe something like yeah, right over here. I've been doing a practice time run, easy like 30 minute potential time save so far. Nice. I mean, hey man, that's what that's why you build in obsolescence. That way, when you go back, you do even better the next time. 
<laughs> Forcing player to have perfect memory. Or like a notepad. <laughs> uh, like, I have a tiny little notepad over here to remind me to go, like, do some certain things. Uh, but they're probably expecting you to have one and, like, write down, like, oh, yeah, I remember seeing this here. Even though that wouldn't help me because the amount of lines it would take isn't worth it. Um, but, you know, when you can just say, use the power of the internet and not do any of the work yourself, uh, then it's so much more fun. You know what? I would rather it just be like a, like a, like a money exchange kind of deal. <laughs> Where it's like, hey, you, uh, uh, <laughs> You spent X, uh, you, you could use X amount of regular berries to buy a crystal berry. That would be preferable to me. Do I have to do that? Okay, cool. Hey, how's it going? Um, where are you? Uh, digs, oh, there it is. Hey, everyone who can't use Sirius Guide for Lost Judgment, because it just came out. <laughs> oh yeah, I've heard that Lo Lost Judgment is the new Yakuza game, right? Or it's like, because it, there was like Yakuza Judgment, and then this is the new one. I've heard I've heard really good things about it, or like people are really enjoying it at least. Here we go. A sequel for Judgment. I've, so I was actually listening to a podcast talking about it. Um, is the same? Uh, well, actually no, because apparently um, the the main reason why the Judgment games or game isn't on um, PC is because the um, <clears throat> the at least the main character from the first I don't know if it has uh, if it's the same main character from the second but basically they use a lot of like real life likenesses and the main character he's part of a talent agency and that talent agency just hates the internet like they don't believe in having anything on the internet like whether it be like, the likeness of their uh, various talents. Like, they don't even have pictures of them on the internet. Uh, magazines on the internet don't, like, forcibly have their pictures removed and shit. So, basically, uh, Sega made this game that they can't put on Steam because they can't get it permission from the, uh, the talent agency. <laughs> So, I thought that was hilarious. How'd you get back here? Well, if you want me to try and find things you haven't found yet, please talk to me from the front. Here, to come remember my faded scare. Please refrain from doing it again, though. Even though I was expecting it, it really gave me a scare. That's the main story. The MC is a super big name, and they probably believe that if it's on the PC, they lose some of their ownership of his image. I mean, yeah, that's basically it. That's their fear of, like, oh, if you put it on PC, they can just do anything with his image, and it'll somehow devalue this guy's talent and worth. <laughs> and then... Literally, you go over to anywhere else in the world, or even in Japan. <laughs> it's like, hey, look at these movies on streaming services. <laughs> Does having all of the Avengers and all that stuff on, on, on a streaming service devalue Robert Downey Jr.? <laughs> Probably not. Especially given that, um... I think it was, like, calculated where, like, having... Uh, Mr. Downey Jr. in, uh, in, like, uh, an Avengers movie, like, increased its, like, box office, like, yield by, like, some millions. <laughs> like, ones that had him in it were much higher than ones that did not. Um, and that may have been, uh, uh, a l that may have been an aspect of just, like, the movies that I appeared in may have just been more hyped up, or it was just happenstance. But I do need to... I, I have an odd experience with watching, like, the mainline Avengers or movies, because I got in on, like, the superhero movie thing quite late. Like, I... Like, I was never an Iron Man kid. I never cared about Iron Man. So when the Iron Man movies started coming out, I was like, I don't give a shit. I don't want to go see those. <laughs> um, and Captain America, I was like, okay, that's pretty cool, but I still don't really want to see it. My first Marvel movie that I saw <laughs> was Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 1. And I never went back to any of the movies before that to watch. <laughs> so, 
I saw Captain America in the Winter Soldier, but I didn't see the first one. <laughs> And I didn't see any of the Iron Mans. <laughs> um, and, I, uh, and I didn't see like the fir uh, I didn't see like the first Avengers movie. <laughs> um, and I was just like, huh. Oh well. <laughs> and I still enjoyed it greatly. <laughs> so that was all that mattered to me. Uh, okay, so that's there. Um, uh, yeah. Ah, okay. Uh, actually, I think I may have got that berry. Um, got 13 berries. That's pretty good. Uh, so let's head back. There we go. Drop it in. Uh, okay. Oh, uh, wait. Uh, do it. Yes, I do want to come this way. Well, how are you doing, uh, Fontano and Dargan? Hope you're doing well. All things considered, I uh, know that you're doing well with your second chapter speedruns, Fontano. I'm, uh, I'm thinking that regardless of which game I finish next before I start the next one. So, I'm presuming that I'm closer to finishing uh, first uh, Sky first chapter than I am this game. <laughs> um... But, oh yeah, I bought the house. Uh, this is my house now, and I can come up here. And there was a metal up here. Uh, okay, I don't know if I'll do a stream of the run. Maybe if I get under six. Okay. Yeah, the, it does seem like the... Uh, uh, my first chapter was like nine hours on the... Do, uh, do you do like no turbo? Or is it with turbo? Because I feel like I see a lot of like the longer ones as, like, the no-turbo category. Uh, I wonder if this pile gets bigger based on how many I buy. Uh, first chapter was no-turbo, second chapter was modified turbo. So what was modified turbo entail? Uh, we'd like to see more metals. Could do super block. No. no movement, but everything else is fine. Oh, okay. Dude, that's interesting because the um because the cold steel one it's just like oh yeah you can totally you can totally use turbo <laughs> so long as it is the specific like two in the field four in cutscenes like you do two four turbo um there are no turbo categories but that's the thing um uh weirdest thing for me oh yeah i never saw any i don't the only thor i saw was the third one <laughs> I only saw uh, Thor Ragnarok. <laughs> and I found the Thor Conrad God Bomb, and he's been my favorite main Avenger here since. Well, mod turbo is 6-6, six, six, like turbo. Like zero, damn. Six turbo, like six turbo on... Um, see, I don't know if charge up or empower is better. Um, you mean P? Okay. Okay, I'm gonna keep... Uh, there we go, power exchange. So I'm gonna buy this, because that's a good setup one. Come back. And I don't know how much it takes. I think it takes like five. Um, power exchange, yeah, it takes like five. So that, that'll be, that'll be a bit later, probably. Uh, it's mostly because there's so much dialing in Secretary that we have to skip through. Some scenes are legit a minute on turbo. Yeah, I mean, I, I get that. Scenes in Cold Steel are like a minute on turbo sometimes. Especially especially because I do New Game Plus, so I'm able to do... So I'm able to skip past the Lloyd and Rishia stuff by doing only cutscenes. So that's just me, like, holding turbo for, like, three minutes. Uh, if we set field to two times, and scenes are also... Oh, Okay. Okay, so the so the turbo is one to one. It's not, uh, it's not. You can you can't s separate it. Okay. Okay. Um. Okay. So that's good. So I wanted to buy that. Now I have eight. That's fine. And then I got woken up early uh, by work. Asked me to come in early for a missing day shift guy. Had a great tired day. Ooh, that's rough. Yeah, it always, it always sucks when people just, like, don't show up to work. Um, 
Uh, in college, I used to have a job um, at, like, the front desk of the dorms, where basically they would have to hand me the uh, their ID and we would tap it and let them in the building. Um, but it was like a 24-hour, seven-day-a-week kind of deal. So I would usually pick, like, early morning hours when no one was there so I wouldn't have to do anything. Uh, because I didn't mind being up early in the morning and having, like, a half-and-half half sleep schedule. As long as I didn't actually have to do any real work. Um, I would just sit at the desk with my laptop and either play a game or, uh, <laughs> or just watch anime. It was awesome. But, uh... <clears throat> Yeah, it would always suck when it's like, okay, it's 6 o'clock in the morning and I've been here for three hours. It would be great if my replacement came because I see them on the time thing and they're supposed to be here for the next two hours. And they didn't... Okay, they're not here an hour in. Okay, they're not... Okay, it looks like I'm just taking their full shift. My money, not theirs. <laughs> so, yay. Um... Oh yeah, I'm heading back to the desert. Er, wait, mm, mm, which way's the fastest? Uh, I'm already here. Let's just run this way. Uh, damn. Uh, yeah, just uh, just battle on the field where field is everything not in battle. Damn dragon had to work six hours on my day off. Ooh, god damn man, you got you guys. You guys work so hard. I'm so proud of you guys. Luckily, I work in a, uh, I work in, like, the loan department of a bank, so it's very much like a 9 to 5 deal, uh, and only ever that. I've only ever been called in to work on the weekend one time, and that was because of all, like, the COVID paycheck protection loans that businesses were able to get, um... And basically, they there was such an influx of them that we needed to come in on a Saturday to even have enough time to submit them all. F fall back! Oh, hello. Whoa! What a vicious beast! They really aren't making getting all the artifacts simple. You better stop talking and start fighting. Um... I want to know what you're called. What are you called? Dune Scorpion? Uh, let me look up something real quick. Uh, Dune Scorpion Bug Fables Hard Mode. Drop anything? Uh, okay, you know what? I'm just gonna do my little bug fables hard mode. Uh, what is this? Cold Steel Three? <laughs> uh, no, this is not Cold Steel Three. Although I will be. Uh... Actually, I don't know when I'm gonna play that again. Maybe. Okay, Hard Charge. What's that? Hard Charge is uh, hard, which gains maximum charge at the cost of five HP. Um. Okay, well, there is a hard mode medal, so I want to try and get it. Um, so, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to take a purposeful loss. God damn B-Boss. <laughs> yeah, I think I remember that one. It wasn't too great. Okay, so I'm just going to purposefully take a loss um, while also spying, so I don't have to do that next time. Uh, I mean, it's not terrible, 12.30 to 11 p.m., so only two hours. Luckily, I didn't have to do any of the other guys. Full four-hour shift. I have a bad tendency to accuse, uh, accuse hyperboles, uh, but I'm still tired. I mean, hey, man. Still isn't fun when you have to work when someone else should be working. <laughs> Barely dodge that. It's hard to speak when being assailed so violently. And yet, it's my duty to draw this attack in. Be leaf. Let's do this together. Um, okay, so let's... One, two, three, four. Uh, it was outside Raquel. Just has death blow attacking. Ah, yeah. Yep. Yeah, and any 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 enemy that just has like an insta kill move really sucks. Ah, oh, yeah. I got my tiny little mother chomper. So. So now he he is uh, 
a bit of extra damage. Uh, do I not have favorite one on? Oh, wait. Uh, maybe I don't. And why am I blocking perfectly? I should... Okay. I don't know why I'm even doing this. I should be doing do nothings. And then just taking my hits. Okay, he totally does have favorite one on. But yeah, the TP core gives me... Um, the TP core gives me... Uh, oop, that was square. Um, 2 TP every... Uh, every second... Um, Every second uh, turn, I get two TP, which is awesome. And do nothing. See, I wish I could kind of flee so I didn't have to do this. I wish I could just. Actually, I kind of, I kind of wish the way it worked was I could just equip medals <laughs> in the fight, because that would be pretty nice. Right now, I'm just using Chomper to get used to doing Chomper things. Okay, good. That's what I look for in my... Uh, anyway, okay. You got 30 health. Um, I'm curious. So I got, I got that, and I have the ADPP. Ooh, increases my... Ooh, okay, so that's the thing. So it increases the number of hits, but also increases the TP used. Uh, well, let's try it. Damn, okay, yeah. And if she was poisoned, she'd be doing even more. <laughs> so that's... that's that big one. Okay. The reason I blocked that is because I want to try and get used to blocking that move. But yeah, having the mother... Ch uh, the little Chompy, uh, who I named Reginald, um, because Reginald is a good name. Uh, speaking of work on days, I have a shock sneaking suspicion. I'm going to be asked to work an extra shift next Saturday. Hopefully, just for. I mean, you could also you could also just like you know not work the extra shift, right? Like you just say, uh, "No, nah, I'm sorry, I'm busy. I have to go to a funeral or something." Okay. Uh. Okay. No, that's fine. I I thought I was going to get a. Okay. There we go. Change loadout. Retry. Hard mode. There we go. I wanted to turn that on. So now y'all have a little bit more health, but. I can do a bit more. Nobody would believe that I'm busy. <laughs> That's why I said funeral. <laughs> because, you know, you can't really can't really accuse someone of like, oh yeah, you're just lying about someone dying. That would be very rude. Uh, okay. So... I, okay. So, how do I want to do this? Here's how I want to do this. Affid egg. V. Okay, poisoned. Skills. Power V. Skills. Hurricane toss. Uh, yeah, well, because my mom works at my job as well. I'd have to get her in. <laughs> I mean, you could, you could, you don't have to say it's a family member that died. <laughs> Okay. Can I turn me later? Okay, so that was just a waste of a turn. Oh no, it gives me two. Okay, so I get two turns with her. Okay, that's not a waste waste, but it's still not great. Any items that do that. Do you have any skills that go three? I think next turn will be a second turn. Yeah. 
it's a second turn. So you do 17 damage. Uh, Hmm. This item. This three two and then four damage. Okay, cool. My little boy, you got the kill. Look at him. Look at my little boy. Look at my little boy Reginald. Hey Reggie! That was really close. You truly have come far. Good job, everyone. Ah, Leaf! No! Oh, God, Leaf, you just... What the heck is going on with your sternum? What the... What is this? Leaf? Curses. What do we... Oh. Yeah, Zasp. How's it going, my bro? It wasn't fast enough. Leaf! Leaf! There's no time. Do as I say if you value your friend's life. No, my ice boy. It's a failure. Yet another one. Disgusting. It keeps up like this, our research. <sighs> Throw it out with the others. We should call it a day. Yeah, uh, I'm off to lunch. Yeah, I'll be back in a minute. Okay, see you later, Dargan. A failure? What are we? I don't know what you are, but you're a pretty cool guy. Leaf! Leaf! Oh, hi, Zasp. <laughs> Leaf, please, you have to wake up. I like my little chomper right there. <laughs> Just hanging. Oi, right, knock it off already. He lives. Made sure to treat the wound. So what were those things coming out of him? Doesn't matter. Only that Leaf wakes up. I can't lose someone again. And stop shaking him. He'll come around. Uh, uh. Leaf, goodness gracious, you had me in the most deep of panics. No kidding, he's been shouting for hours. Uh, um, but I was really worried too. Zaz, where are we? What happened? You let your guard down like a fool and got shanked. <laughs> he just shaved, shanked. <laughs> Zaz jumped in and broke that scorpion's face. Don't thank me, I had a debt to settle. Those things inside us. What kind of abomination are we? Leaf, it doesn't matter. It only matters that you yet breathe. I've lost so many. I truly feared we would lose you. So it doesn't matter. Y yeah, the doctor said you had weird stuff in you anyways. V. Kabu. No touching. Guess my work here is done. <laughs> Sass, even with what you said. Thank you. It's hard to find good friends. You'd best go get that artifact before Mathiva ends her vacation. Smoke bomb. That's right. I heard these voices. Something about research. It must be connected to us. We can't stop now. What if the castle holds answers? Are you gonna be okay? It was looking super bad. Doesn't matter if Mathiva gets the artifact. We could always go rest at the inn. No, we can feel that's important. We will go. We must go. Would you help us just a little bit longer? As if you had to ask, Team Snakemont's gonna get that treasure. Then it is settled. Let's proceed to the sand castle. Okay, cool. I'm all healed up now. Meow, going north. Meow, north. What's up? Sandcastle. There is a hole. 
Uh, how about... A sandcastle key! Clickety-clack. Gonna get that artifact back. Wow. I just tried to hold down R2 for turbo mode, but that's not this game. Whoa, that thing's huge! Makes the Ant Palace look like a cheap inn! Truly, I've never seen such an impressive structure. I wonder if it'd make the Queen somewhat jealous. So the artifact must be here, then. Will you truly be okay, Leaf? You really can't just go back if you feel bad, you know? Thank you for your concern, but we'll manage. Be ready, though. This doesn't look like an easy place to explore. What are you talking about? It looks like the easiest place to explore. Um, but I presume I need the... There we go. Where's the sorcery? Nice magic. Thought you'd seen it before. <laughs> it's not the same. Nice magic is your thing. True. Could this place be related to us? Only one way to find out. Time to explore. Let's be careful, please. We've let our guard down too many times during this mission. So keep our eyes open. Uh-huh. Okay, so there's no, like, ice physics on the, on the stuff. Okay, will you just, like, hit the thing? <laughs> Thank you. It is a good song. It is a good track. This is a bug or a bot. Mega weird. Even changes color when it's cold. Okay, so it... So if I wonder if that makes it weaker to Kabu's hits. I think my beam ring is always gonna work though. Okay, so so basically what you're saying is hit it with him first, turns it cold. Okay, maybe not. One, two, three, four. Oh, okay. A bit quicker than I was expecting. Wasn't sure what that was gonna be. Two, three, four, boom. Yeah, give me them exploration points. Still got hard mode on, but until it becomes a problem, I guess I'll just keep it on. That way I don't forget to put it on before a boss. Uh, and so that I can, um, Get a little bit more XP, for what it's worth. Okay, so I can't, can't, uh, uh, I can't dig into those. Um, okay. So, oop. there we go. Bam! Do 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 Even perfect, it does three damage. Should also be a bit more free with my TP now. Now that I have the TP core, so I can at least have a backup. I think what I'll probably do 
is use TP to heal uh, heal people with the secret stash move more than anything. Okay, what's going on with you, buddy? Get off! Get off me! Jeez, this thing's got issues. Haunted cloth. You can't let it get too close, so I'd best get smacking. Uh, okay. So let's... Damn it. Bad. Take I'm I'm so tempted to think like, oh yeah, this doesn't uh this isn't all that great. Like nine, but I'm like, eh, it only takes a hundred. Um Wait, how the heck predicting that one. Ooh, and I don't have, like, any healing items. I am, like, woefully underprepared for this. I should probably leave. <laughs> Gotcha. I figured you out. It wasn't very complex.
I was hoping I could get like a diagonal throw. But game wasn't having it. Damn it. Uh. Gotcha, bitch. Opens the door in the ancient castle. Oh, hardcore parkour right there. Here we come for healing. Uh, do I want healing? Um, yeah, heal us. But um, I do need to exit this place. Okay. Yeah, I need. I need. Like my inventory just isn't there. <laughs> I got I got a thing that heals my TP but shocks me. And that's about it. So I'm going to try and uh, figure out what path I need to take to get to the um, Hornet uh, people the fastest. I think it's this way, because I think this way takes me out to where we fight the, uh, where we fought the bandits originally. Yeah. Okay. A bit, a bit longer than I was expecting. if there's someone whose silk was stolen here or not. What's up, dude? Hi, nice, still looking? Yes, yeah, so I'm gonna say Divine Rear's got charm. Really? The same doesn't do much. That's not the most prosperous. People will work to end. There's, there's some bands. It's dark side of the Tylenet community. It's a good place to call home. Not yet, but I hope we'll bump into each other once more. Safe travels. Okay. Oh, wait, how much? I have 61 berries. That's not enough to buy all the things I want. Damn it. Yeah, it probably would have just been faster for me to go back to the uh, thing. Wish they gave me, like, an item to remotely access my bank. <laughs> That would be pretty cool. Lost item. Lost the collector's item last time. It was somewhere in the Sunset Inn. You get to find a discreet place for the reward when you find it. The Sunset Inn. Don't know what 
talking about. I'm pretty sure that was the sunset, and I mean, it looks like a sunset. But let's come over this way. Okay. Hey, three thousand forty-six. Withdraw. Um. Withdraw. Uh, let's withdraw. Three hundred. 39. Now. Okay. 400 berries. That's. I think I could carry that on me without thinking that uh, it's too much. Because the thing is, I don't run from battles very often. Uh, unless I'm a very non happy camper. And that's really the only way you lose berries other than spending them. <laughs> Okay, and define a root. Okay. Oh, god damn it. Gotta go up. So what items do you have in you? I'm gonna take out that tangy berry, spicy berry, crunchy leaf, dark cherries. Okay. So I like you. Two, three, one, two, three. These freeze and do that. One, two, three. Frankly, I'll buy a few more of these. I'll store. I'll store that. I'll store that. Okay. And the reason why I'm storing a whole bunch is because at least I'll have them to take out. Because this is kind of. This is kind of like an annoying area to have to come back to. Okay. I'm all filled up. Got, got plenty of honey leaf glazed things. And I got a magic seed. So that's... That is fine. Now I'm all kind of hopped up on the things I need to be hopped up on. Um, let's, let's go to HB, and let's try, uh, one of the bosses or something. So I'll, uh, take off hard mode, uh, take off bug me not, take off that, and then... Life stealer. Triumph buzz. After a successful battle, the party gets X amount back. That might be worth it. There's nothing else that I really want to take off. So, let's put on Poison Defender on her again. Okay. Hey, how's it going? What boss stands for? Uh. Okay. And crystal data line, cobble leaf. I can assist you. Um. Rush mode. Uh. Yeah. Let's do mini bosses. 
six available enemies, and then, yeah, sure. Let's go. Because I think having the, having Chompy, having full equip, having a V, uh, that is pretty darn good. Um, I'll let Kabu go um, first. Um, actually, no, I won't. Put V up front. Um, there we go. Three. Boom. And then skill. Yeah, you guys. It was just freeze. Yeah. Change ribbon. Ready ribbon. Okay. Here we go. And then. I'll put Kabu up front. Four. Four. Two. Get eight damage. Um, I'll do that. Two. Three. Damn. So I'm a Venus plant. You, like, how many things are you going to do in one turn, guy? Three. Okay, so we still have to kill the Venus plant. mini-boss only took... I probably shouldn't have hard mode on for these guys. Uh, but, uh, still five out. Yeah, we are ready. Alright, here it comes. Did I take hard mode off? I can't remember if I took hard mode off. Um, stays on skill I mean, let's see if I can't just do this there we go do nothing okay one two three four three Okay, cool. Didn't take my input. Okay, for some reason my controller's turning off. What, uh... Does not charge or something? Three. Damn it. Fuck. Okay, yep, yeah, that's it. Doesn't have charge. For some fucking reason. Explains why I didn't get any inputs. That is, of course, okay. there. This is why I wish I could get like a wired PS4 controller, but they don't make those. They're only like off brand ones that I don't really want to get. I'm also debating whether or not I just want to, uh, and of course I don't have audio anymore because for some reason, plugging in through here, fucks with that. Uh, so, one, two, three, four, boom. 
uh, items. And leaf. Shop. There we go. Skills. How much shot do you have? You have 16. Damage now to uh, you guys still have audio, correct? Yeah, it looks like you do. Holy shit! And power two really doesn't help. However, I don't really have to worry about it because you only have one health anyway. Okay. Good work, but still heal me up first. That one did quite a bit of damage to me. Ah, fuck, it's a Stotleys. Um. Okay. This is one that I'm probably gonna have to go hard on from the beginning. Um. Uh, and this is the one that doesn't let me use um, items, so I can't do that. Okay, so here's how I'm gonna have to do it. I'm gonna have to just try and go with V the entire time. Nope. Hurricane toss. Two. Good. Jump. Three damage down. Okay. Uh, I don't know if he makes it so... Uh, I actually want to look that up. Um, Stothelys, Bug Fables. Uh, Leonardo Series of Mid-Boss. Sells energy. Okay. English personality, diary, vow, attack, or after taking that damage, you begin to attack twice. After being damaged, you have a chance to defense, being hit by a flipping will cancel, and cannot be used while fighting, even if he is frozen or asleep, and attempts to use them will result in worse turns. However, okay, so I literally, there's no way I can use items during this fight. Fun. Um. Great. Um. Okay. So the only, um. So the only uh, TP I get is basically the uh, TP core. So I'm gonna use this. Two, one, one, one. Good. Okay. Still does a lot of damage. Um. Do that because what that'll do is it'll cancel out his guard. That increases his defense to two. Uh, for Chompy to come in here for a nice one. Here we go. See, not having it, not having any sound cues, really fucking blows. Um. Okay. I'm just gonna have to go pretty hard on. Uh, actually. Because I, ca I can't really do anything. I don't wanna say do anything. But uh, I need to be a bit careful, because I can't heal. Other than V's using Secret Stash. Um, but I think... V has been unable to act for one turn. Which kind of sucks. Okay, so 
here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do this. Freeze him. Good. Heavy strike. Two, three, four, five, six. Do six damage. Two. I could hear. That would be pretty cool. Good work. Impressive. You exceeded my expectations. Have a little something. It's on me. Got Spy Specs Metal. Uh, a metal made by Dr. HB. Allows the party to see enemy HP without spying. And spying won't spend a turn. Um, okay. So, I'm looking up. Uh... Excuse me, looking up the rewards for the boss system. Okay, so defeating third boss and the boss rush. Um, I mode will award that. Defeating the sixth will award that. And completing the seventh and either the unlock that, which features. Right. Okay, so I want to defeat the sixth. Um, so I want to get all the way there. Got spice. Okay, but that's cool. Uh, you know what? For doing that, Dab City. D -d 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 Dab. Okay. There's still three battles left. Uh, are you ready? Heal up. Okay. And this is the guy that I just beat. So that's fine. Um, let's start with. Uh, start with this. Just do one normal turn. Get him to... Just do, like, some damage, basically. I messed up. Okay, they go up. And I can swap them over. He can use a um, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Going to do hurricane toss. There's one, one, cool. And then you can use honeyed leaf on her. There's a TP back. You can relay your turn to her. She can use another hurricane toss. Do quite a bit of damage. You can chomp. Damn it. It is so flipping hard to do it. Like, like, it is actually surprising how much the music kind of helps. Um, not that I think it would really make me all that much better, all things considered, but it definitely helps. Because uh, it almost adds, like, a constant, like... A, a constant thing in the back that lets you just kind of focus on in addition to what we have. Uh, okay, I'll just do a, a regular turn. It, seeing four is so odd. <laughs> okay, so two damage, two uh, life. Um, I think I only have one heal left. So... So I'm gonna use um, on you. Use I have two more leaf omelets, glazed honeys. Use them on you, and you can go chomp him for two damage and kill. Three. 
And they really don't want you to be, like, grinding XP on in the boss rushes. They give you, like, nothing. Good work, but there's still two battles left. So I'll do this battle, and then for the last one, I will heal up. Here it comes. Okay, so this is Monsieur Scarlet. Um, okay. So this is one where I do want to do, like, the full setup. Get, like, the empower and everything. Damn it, the wrong one. Two. And luckily, having Chompy around is pretty good. Um, okay, I can move him there. Um, and then flop a. Oh, that was not her. And then. I can use power on her. So now she's got two up, poison bo boost, and a plus three. So Hurricane, that guy doesn't have any. Um, let's do Hurricane Toss. Uh, 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 uh. Five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> I went from 33 to 18. Here we go. Okay. That's perfectly fine. Um, so let's do one of you. Uh, 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 uh. Perfect. One, one, one. Boop, boop. That's six HP. Um. Okay. Now, don't have to worry because I'm going to be healing. One, two, three, X. I'm going to be healing um, on after this fight. Good. <sighs> Four exploration points. Just realized how smart it is to call them exploration points because you keep the EXP uh, acronym. Ah, okay. And then these two. Honestly, not too worried about these two. Um, uh, because if I remember right, I wish I could access their information. One, two, three, four, three. Wish I could access their information without um. Without having to spy on them again. Four. Okay. Now allow me to beat her up a little bit. Oh wait, I don't want to break my. That's good because that gives them their setup, so I can swap them out. I can plop a delicious honeyed leaf on you. Poisons you. You come over here. Power her. You come over here. Hurricane. And you just rinse the hell out of her. Um, you know, I guess I'll take the bonus damage on that. Oop. Oop. Fucking Christ. Uh, he can do dash through. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, take them out. He just, like, glitched in the Matrix or something. Um, that's perfectly fine, because he's not gonna survive very long. <laughs> because the poison setup with Hurricane Toss doing extra hits, and with the Empower, and with the boost from the favorite one, pretty darn strong. 
Oh, ho, good work. Impressive. You've exceeded my expectations. Have a little something. It's on me. Got detector metal. Metal made by Dr. H.B. Beeps if there are interesting objects nearby. So basically, if I have this on, uh, I believe if I enter a room and there's a crystal berry in it, it will go like, hey, beep, there's something here. Good job, everyone. That was a fierce battle. Here's something for your trouble. Got 60 berries. Nice. You want to try again? Just start with the, the boss once more. Can't wait to see who perform next time. Uh, and I chose the main bosses because they'll be a bit faster and better. And as you can see, they're not here anymore. Okay. So what I want to do is I want to save. And uh, I would like to turn to the main menu. Uh, I'm actually going to close the game and open it again. Because I'm just not getting any audio. And I would rather... Yeah, okay, so that's what it is. Fucking... When I plug in my controller, it changes the entire audio of, um... Of the stream. Or of the, uh... Of the... Um... Of the... Thing. Uh... To... Like, my entire computer, it goes to... The wrong source it, it just like switches the entire thing over to the wrong thing okay and i think you're still getting the audio let me check my monitor one okay you're good which is awesome because i didn't want to I didn't want to sacrifice your music for mine, but I also didn't want to sacrifice mine because I don't think I would play as well. Uh, okay, so that's good. And now, the nice part about the boss is it doesn't actually use any of the items, which is also why I was fine with doing it. So, now, what I'll do is I will head back to the sandcastle, now that I am kind of fully prepped with a whole bunch of items. Ready and waiting for anything that they might throw at me, I say now, as I am ill. I am woefully ill-prepared for whatever they could throw at me. Um, and now, I'll just talk to you. And now I'll just run there. Uh, inventory, okay, have, bug me not, okay. Um... Take off that second one. Uh, make it so they can't get me like that. Put that on. Uh, you know what? I'll put that on. I think that's good. Um, oh, did I take that off? Okay, never mind. Um, fuck me now. I was putting it on, not turning it off. Um, same thing. Worth it. I could take off. Not really. Okay. Just have to take it like it is, right there. But I'm, I'm very close to leveling. So, I need, I need three uh, experience. Uh, and then I will level. So, what I might just do is uh, expend however much I need to to get the level in terms of TP and all that junk. Um, and then heal myself afterwards. Um, two. One. One, two, three, four. Also, I was on hard mode before with these guys. Now I'm not, so they'll go down a bit easier. Hit the wrong button. Uh, so I almost one-turned them. One, two, three, four. Boom. Okay, you're done. Gave me five. Good. Leveled up. That's what I like to see. Yeah! Give me some more metal points. 
Because I'm getting to that part where I kind of need needle pincer. Okay. Getting to that point where <laughs> every, every time I'm like, I want to do this, I need more metal points. So, uh, let's put on spy specs. And is there one that I want that's only worth two? Um, not really. Um, so what I'll do is I will just put on another poison defender, make her super beefy, and then I will just go in here. Okay, so that means, this means there is something special in here. Um, so, in your castle, in your... At, least, at least I believe so. Yeah, nothing in here. But I enter here, and it's like, hey, there's something here. Whether or not you can get it, I don't know. Need your key. But it's probably upstairs. I think I probably have to hit that thing and go somewhere. Uh, okay. I don't know what you are. Spy. Okay, oof, what conniving disguise. We really must be on guard here. Uh, my horn will be ready to strike when it's brought back into the ground. Okay. Two. One, two, three, four. Good. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Good. Killed it in one turn. I don't even need to see what its attacks are. Although I should probably try and see what its attacks are. Okay. So. Three. One, two, three, four. Okay, cool. <laughs> Still didn't get to see it even with one less turn. <laughs> Got a magic ice. Uh, this ice cube will never melt. Tells our enemy try to freeze it. Um, I don't. I would much rather have all my healing items than something like. Mix the powers. Okay. That's not how... So th that's one of the annoying parts about having this kind of graphics, where I wanted to throw the thing this way, but because it only has essentially two versions of a front sprite that don't delineate whether or not you're facing quote unquote towards the screen or somewhere else, it's really annoying. Um. Additionally, the game doesn't want to seem to actually listen to me. Because if I remember right, the way it's supposed to work is that if I... If I throw it there... Okay, so... How... Isn't it supposed to... Okay, so why isn't it happening the way I need it to now, this time? Is it if it hits something? 
Is that what it is? I guess. So... Need to be facing away from it. There we go. Okay, so that's interesting. So if you tag something, then it uh, doesn't hold it in the right way. Three. One, two, three, four. Three. One, two, three, four. Two. So it just sucks out health the longer it's on you. Okay. There we go. Uh, I'm just gonna secret stash and heal her like this. Because I'm gonna get 2 TP next time. <laughs> Hey, Dargan. How was dinner? I had uh, leftover chicken legs and cream corn and potato for dinner. Yeah, because on Monday or Sunday, what I did was I just, like, I took my entire thing of, like, I, I went to nearby Shaw's or something a while ago, and I had, um, purchased one of the, uh, one of those, well, it was like the, a pack of, um, it's like a pack of chicken legs. Like, just the, uh, her potato I've been summoned. Hey, Tay, how's it going? Um, PB&J, like, I've had almost every workday of my life. Oh, yeah, I, I, I've been having PB&J for lunch. But, uh, yeah, I went, I went to Shaw's, got one of those, um, okay, bullshit. Um, there we go. Gotcha, bitch. Uh, Irishman Tay. And school day. Yeah, uh, when I was going to school, it was usually a, uh, like some kind of meat sandwich. Um... Yeah. Yeah. What the heck? Why would I need to come back here? Might as well be. <laughs> um. Oh, is it like once it gets over it? How the hell does this... What, did, what is going on over here? Okay, so you go that way. Oh! Okay, so I need... Okay. Uh, damn it, bullshit. We could share that. We could share that lane. Uh, sometimes I'll deviate to Nutella and Jam, but uh, I'll get nauseous after three months. Fuck! I've never had Nutella and jam. Oddly enough, I've never had Nutella on a sandwich. I've only ever just had it straight. <laughs> because the only time I think I remember... Like, the only time I've ever gotten it, I've never bought it myself. It was always given to me. And... Um... <clears throat> what would happen would be like, oh, I just get it. And I'm, it would be just like on my desk. And I would just like take a spoonful of it every now and then. <laughs> So I never actually bothered to put it onto pieces of bread. <laughs> but yeah. Peanut butter and jelly. Peanut butter and fluff. I'd fuck with that a lot. I love fluff. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Boom. There we go. Oop, okay, so you freeze things. Good to know. Should have presumed it based on the icicles around your face, but you know. So, 
got a shocker. We got a freezer. Okay, good. And luckily, it's a pretty forgiving timing on the laser. And it does minor damage. Kaboo. A bit more health. Four. I no, only did two. Good. You went for the one to get back. Skills three. Let's get Kabu again. Yeah, what I, uh, I was saying earlier, I went to, like, I got one of those, like, deals at Shaw's where it was, like, probably right before, like, they couldn't sell dates, so they, like, a full pack of, like, ten chicken drumsticks was on sale for, like, four bucks. <laughs> so, and th whenever that happens, what I do is I'll, uh, I'll just buy a few of them and put them in the freezer. So I unfroze some, and then, uh and throw some and then cook them all on like a sheet tray at once so I'll just have leftovers throughout the week because before streams I don't really like to cook I'll just heat something up in the microwave instead um. oh oh god damn it how about peanut butter on toast a little honey drizzle over it. I've never had honey on it but yeah peanut butter on toast is good So is this just saying it's... In the vicinity? Ah, uh -huh, I see you. I see what you're putting down here. Ha uh ha, -huh, go through the window. And convenient that there is a walkway outside this window when, this bri when there was a bridge that used to be there. Okay. It. What the heck is going on in here? What's up? Okay, I didn't get to look at it. Frostbite metal. Frostbite. Reflects all direct damage taken by a frozen ally to the striking enemy with a chance to freeze. Okay. So this is like a... A... You want your ally to be frozen? <laughs> Build? <laughs> Where it's just like, hey, yeah, attack this guy and just damage them with the deflect. That's neat. Okay, so uh, well, what's your deal? Your high immunity area, regular maintenance of cryo crystal must not be neglected. Uh, in the castle. Uh, yeah, in the rolling rock room, after the first rock, use leaf shield ability to cross the spikes into a secret room between, betwixt two pillars. Yep, let's go off. Need to go back. Yeah, let me in. Let me in! Actually, I think I can just go over this way. Nope, that's annoying. Rather go this way. Come on. Eh. Oh god damn it! Did I turn it off? So 
after the first rock, go over the spikes into a secret room. Thought I had already gone over those spikes. Okay. Ah, oh, there we go. I went over the other ones. There we go. Sup, bro? Eh. Hey, you're getting bullied. How does it feel to get bullied that hard? Idiot. Ugh. Must feel pretty stupid right now. Um, yeah, let's do this. Three. One, two, three, four. Two. Um, I'm gonna have you there. Because I want you to take this guy down. Because Kabu might kill this scorpion here. But if he did, I would have wanted... Because Chomper kind of goes... Or Reginald goes on the same rules as Kabu, where he only attacks the first grounded enemy. So I wanted to make sure that I wasn't uh, potentially going to be... Not going to be able to attack with him. But overkill is better than not killed at all, so... I'll take that. There we go. Ugh. Uh... But yeah, I, th I think I started th this probably near the beginning of the stream. But uh, after after I beat Bug Fables um, and or well a after I beat Cold Steel or not Cold Steel after I beat first chapter Dread in the Sky before I start the next game what I'm gonna do is I'm probably gonna spend a stream or two like that block the next week. Uh, maybe doing, um, maybe doing, uh, oh, god damn it, I need to go out around, um, doing, like, just try one or two speedruns of Cold Steel, uh, because it's been a bit since I've done that, I, I kind of want to do it again before I start up another game, and then I might just do a messing around stream, uh, on a... Uh, a different one. Um, okay. So, and then I have the blue. So, I think it's. Oh, uh, it's one of, like, the Pokemon puzzles. Is there something here? go. Uh, okay. And now I can just come back here. No way for me. God damn it. Uh, but yeah, it'll be fun to go back to uh, Cold Steel 2 and do a, do a nice quick speed run. Using all the turbo mode I want. So let's. Because I believe, like, no turbo is, like, around six hours, but with turbo, it's, like, RTA. It's about three something. Um, but without loads, it's, like, two and a half. So it's pretty nice. Good, so that's actually gonna be perfect for Mr. Chompy. Good block. And let's just do it again. One. There we go. Did, uh, did that fight with no damage taken. Although it's kind of annoying because I did it in two two turns but i don't believe i get the tp core benefit until the like second turn second one? okay so i want to get that key it's going 
first we felt cold at the tip of our hands before it turned into drops sinking into the sand. Then we felt the cold at our feet before locking away. Oh, okay. I think I need to freeze these guys and put them on the... Uh, combination I'll just do this. I thought it was going to be like, oh, there's going to be like four enemies and I have to freeze them all and bring them down on the things, but I guess not. There we go. Eight expiration points! Eight XP! Eight XP! Wait, wait, wait. That berry. Yeah, there we go. Don't want to waste any berries. Um... How are the bugs doing? Oh, they're, they're, I think they're doing pretty good. You know, they're chilling out. Right? Um. Okay, so maybe it's a maybe it's a hint or something. First, we felt cold at the tip of our hands before it turned into drops sinking into the sand. Then we felt cold at our feet before locking the way. So like, tip of the hands. And maybe maybe I can just do this. Maybe this is the key. Maybe I just build a staircase. fight you, but whatever. I guess what I should do is when they're coming, just use Leaf some. Just use Leaf's shield so they'll just break on him. And then he can freeze them at, at that point. You need to check. You can tell the music. Should... Oh yeah, right. Like it gives super. Like the vibes it gives are easily like. Oh yeah, this is desert. Come on. Fuck. Okay. What the hell? Oh, okay. So they stay frozen so long as they're in the, um, so long as they're in the, uh, area. Okay. So that's the, that's the trick. That's the ticket. 
Okay, and if I need to reset it, what I do is I just turn that off. And it'll come out. There we go. See, this probably isn't the intended method, but, you know, it's the method that I'm going to try. Ah, you son of a bitch. Fuck! Why couldn't you just make it water? Instead of these stupid ass crabs. And I get it. Like I'm probably not supposed to try be trying to do this, but I put I already put two on the things. I already tried. You saw me try. There are two on the things. They're two depressing them. Couldn't depress the others. I, I gave it an honest shot. But no. I go over here. Two on the... I tried, yeah, I put two on the things. Because it was just like, hey, look at this. Tip of the hands, and the feet. Like... Tip of the hands, and it's just like, okay, what do I do now? Do I go on the feet? Doesn't do anything. I don't see any changes to the world. Did it change anything? No, doesn't do anything. So I'm like, well... What's the next logical step? Well, put them down here on this one. And I tried that. Because it turns it off and something happens. You son of a bitch. How about... Like, why are you so oddly high? Okay, that wasn't there before. So now... I guess it's fine. I guess it was ch counting, maybe? You know, I, I still agree with my idea of trying to just stack them up like a set of stairs. <laughs> Cheese it. Um, Could have sworn that there was... Is there a... Feels like this should be like a secret or something. Oop. Interesting. So I'm able to dig here. Is this like a door I can go under? No. Because there was one. I feel like I remember there being something about mentioning one of these kinds of rooms. I'm gonna move by one of the first keys on the right. Yeah, that's one. I'm gonna roll in the rocks room. Because I, I feel like I remember that being given direction. Okay, only been like a three hour break. Totally RTA huh? <laughs> Yeah. Dude, totally RTA, man. RTA is whatever you need it to be, right? Why are you so oddly high? Cut to a guy eating a straight-up cannabis leaf. <laughs> How high would that actually get you? Because isn't, like... Like, isn't the entire thing... Like, you have to smoke it, or, like, cook it in some way to release, like, the oils or some junk? Not recording this, so it doesn't matter. I mean, it doesn't. That's what practice runs are for. Uh, I know eating it's stronger, but heating it makes it weaker. Okay. So I guess maybe eating it just straight up would make it better. Because I thought it was like something about like heating up is what caused like the reaction, which is why you had to like smoke it. Or like do some kind of cooking with it. To make it work. So where does that key go? Is there like a room in here? No, because this is the room... This is that room. No. 
I think it's absorbed differently depending on the method. Okay. Oh. There we go. Three. One, two, three, four. And I don't smoke. Any yeah, right. I, I, I have only ever smoked once. And I didn't exactly care for it. I never really wanted to do it again. <laughs> Uh, it'll take a lot, I believe, since things like Wee Brownies take a while to take effect, and those are still ample doses. Yeah, because I, I thought, like, the thing with, like, cooking air, like, putting it into edible format was, like, it hit you super hard, but, like, delayed, because it depends on your stomach digesting it. Whereas, like, like, smoking it because it's going through your respiratory system instead hits you faster, but not necessarily as much. But I also thought, like preparation of the weed was the thing that made it like happen like i didn't think you just put pot leaves in whatever okay i i need to look up to see if there's any hidden stuff in the ancient um uh what was ancient castle um castle there, get ruined, get whatever. Okay, okay, that doesn't help me. Uh, uh, uh can I say, I guess there are way too many maps in Sky that have no maps, and that's my least favorite. Yeah, dude! Trust me, I wish the mini map was more. True, can you tell I've never smoked a weed before? Only ever sat next to two stones in their garage before and learned how to recognize the garbage smell. Yeah. Yeah, that's the that's definitely the worst part about weed. <laughs> it's because of all of the smell. <laughs> it is quite literally just smell. <laughs> um there was something about uh uh, ancient castle bug tables and metals, maybe? Uh, rest a key. Yeah, there we go. Okay, that doesn't help me. Whatever. Okay, I need to find out where this goes. I think that's the I think that's the big draw of like edibles, where you can still get high and all the good stuff without it smelling. Mm. I'm like I live in Massachusetts, so I could totally buy some ed and it's efficient, right? Like, take you take one gummy and you're good. Yeah, where the hell, like, where the hell is this going off on? It's like, I live in Massachusetts. I could go to, like, a, a place and just buy some. But I'm also like, I don't care enough to try again. It's basically the first time I had it. I went at it way too hard. Because uh, the first time I tried, I failed. Because I was doing it out of, like, a bowl. And it couldn't, a bowl is just like a, it's like a pipe, kind of. Looks like an old-timey pipe. Um, yeah, and this is here, so this isn't where I need to be. Um, the second time, someone just brought, like, a pen that had, like, THC or whatever in the, like, cartridge. Took a hit of that, and then it didn't, like, nothing happened for, like, some time. So then I took another hit of it, and my friend was super mad at the person who gave me the pen. Because <laughs> he was like, no, dude, fuck. He's going to be way too high now. <laughs> and, uh, yes. <laughs> that... That was a very truthful statement. <laughs> um, where the fuck do I need to go? Like, I got... Like, I got the key. Um, but yeah. Uh, got way too high. It was n did not an enjoyable experience. So if I ever do try again, I'll 
have to make sure I don't make that mistake again. Although, like alcohol, it's expensive. Like, they don't, they don't make the, they don't make the, the things cheap. Now, whether or not that's a deterrent, like, oh, if we make it expensive, people won't do it. Or, it's a, well, it's expensive because the, well, th th this is one of those things where I actually have a little bit of unfair information, where, like, it takes so much money to get a uh, a pot producer retailer thing set up. Like, it like, you have to go through so many hoops and it costs so much like capital to start it up that you have to sell the products kind of at a more expensive than you could probably get at street cost because you have like a whole bunch of capital to repay or investors or other things. Where the, yeah, I get it. Where the, where the shit? Is it here? Is it this tree? Like, where, where am I going? <laughs> anyway, so finally being with these two guys, though, because instead of mellowing, they both get aggressively political and fight debate for an hour, and then we go back and play more D&D until four in the morning. Yeah, the, the, the thing is, I've never encountered a I've never encountered a aggressive high person. Like, I, I've I, I've encountered people who who were like very much aware and present uh, when they were high. Like they weren't out of it, and they they would talk passionately passionately about things. Um, like as you say, debating aggressively, but never like I'm gonna throw hands while I'm high. Um. Yeah, okay. You know, where the fuck do I go? <laughs> open, close, tab. Um, bug fables, walk through. Um, lost it, that's not a walk through. Stock of chapter four. But, uh, for he, yeah, yeah, I mean, what? Yeah, it doesn't. Same cast navigation problems. Got the second key, can't see the final door. Uh, okay, next room. Ah! Ah! Okay. Figured it out. Um. Figured it out, and by figured it out, I mean, I guess it's like, I guess it's kind of explanatory, but not really, because I guess this time, uh, Basically, what I need to do is now I need to put them on the. Hey, hey, get back here! You fuck! God damn it! You absolute chode! Like, hey, I'm gonna keep aggroing to you, but I'm never gonna hold the aggro long enough to do anything. <laughs> Just long enough to give you hope, and then I'll run away like an asshole. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now respawn so I can freeze your ass. Hey, hey, you wanna? Okay, yeah, boom. God damn it, you bounce off so fucking far. There we go. Okay, so that apparently does. Something. Fun fact, I have to use Wild Rage so much in this run that one of my chapters is subbed out. 5.9k is 70%. <laughs> yeah, because Wild Rage, what? It decreases your health by, like, what, 20% or 30% and gives you 50 CP? If I remember right, Wild Rage. Okay. Never let me have the force, which is a flag to the top right, tells you how to invest in the solution. What the fuck? Okay. Do 
I hitting it now? Where'd you go to go for doing it to see what the fuck? Said this. Uh, world record. Uh, wait. Wild Rage, not World Record 2, gives me 150 CP for 70% HP. Damn! Holy shit. Holy shit, man. Okay, what the fuck? Stick two eyes in the top left, top right, then hit the switch to unfreeze. What the fuck? How is that the solution? Let me look. First we felt the tips before turn of sand drops and sing a sand name was like then we felt the cold our feet before locking the way. Okay, because for some reason that makes sense. So I lost jazz feeding agate for S crafts. That nice. Yeah. Fe feeding S crafts is probably the most uh, common thing between any <laughs> any trails run where it's like you just want to get the super moves as much as possible. <laughs> they'll just make your life so much easier and that's the entire ethos between er, uh, <laughs> behind my strategies in the cold steel 2 speed run because I'm on new game plus so I have advantages so I just put megalith on rain and then I have um, s crafts for literally every battle on him at least um, this is spiraling into a whole story, but one of the guys was a first time DD player, and his character was a druid that constantly used his plant powers to instantly grow psychedelics for his smoking web. Sorry, this is a complete side tangent to what everyone else is talking about. Don't worry about it, man. One of, uh, I haven't, haven't been able to play the campaign in a bit, but, uh, with a couple friends, we have a DD &D group going. And, uh, one of our friends has a druid, and, uh, he just likes turning into animals and seducing any, like, M magic animal that we come across that might try and guide us on our way. He's like, but I'm an animal, man, so it's not weird. And we're just like, okay, you know what? You do you, man. <laughs> you get that horse cock. <laughs> it's all on you anyway. <laughs> Boom. Two. Yeah, you get out of the ground, you asshole. Uh, there we go. Oof. Excuse me while I kill you for a second. Three. Okay, so that's perfectly fine. Here you go, Kabu. Get you back up to 10 health. There we go. Killed you. See, like, getting, getting Reginald is such a good idea early. Because, like, over time you can just see that he gives you so much damage. Like, it's only in, like, one, twos, and threes... Like, piecemeal. However, it is still damage over... Like, over the course of the game, you'll have done hundreds more damage than you would have. So it's it's really worth it. Um, okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to do that. Then... And we're going to do this. Dash through. Damn, it appears it's time. Proceeds to cast Illusionary Dragon spell. Uh, see, I'm not Tiamat appears. Illusionary Dragon spell. Yeah, Tiamat is Tiamat has a dragon. I just can't remember where I'm trying to think of it from. Three, good. No, one. Oh darn. Oh yeah, because he has one defense. Oh, blocked way too early. Did not block early at that time. Good. Uh, nice it's been a while since I last played D&D. &D. Yeah, I mean, I feel like a lot of people either stop playing D&D &D once everything went to shit, or the, 
me and my group, we switched over to playing it on, like, Roll20 using Discord voice chat. Just to keep some semblance of sanity through continued communication. Click on that. Yeah, I just can't tell what this is at all. Seems to be some sort of depiction of the everlasting sapling. Even the artifacts today. I'm impressed, Kabu. The strong quality hasn't aged well at all. Uh -huh. We've got to bring Neo back sometime. He'd love this. The Neo Geo? Get the occasional spark for a new character, and I fall back into the rabbit hole. Tiana has the evil dragon glass with all the evil heads. Glyphs on your dragon. I think it's an eighth level spell in 5e if that's what you play. Yeah, we play 5e uh, because I feel like that's just genuinely what most people play. Um, okay. So, bonk that there. Bonk that there. Hmm. Bonk that there. 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 See, it's one of those things where, like, I could have tried not putting it here. However, my belief is always. The most annoying path is probably the most right. <laughs> um, okay. Oh, can you not? Okay. Eh. Eh. There we go. Because overall, what I think I'm trying, what I think I'm trying to do is I'm trying to get the pillar here, right? Because then I can just jump up here and make a grand leap there. So if I pop that there. Pop that there. Shoot that over there. Do that. Do that. And that. There we go, Governor. Yeah. yeah. Huh. That looks suspicious. Big ancient key. Really fancy key, which unlocks the ancient castle's most fortified room. Uh, yeah, there we go. That's the suspicious part. Enemy twice with nails dealing piercing. Must target. Needle toss. V tosses some piercing darts at enemies. doesn't target all of them. Um, okay, so here is what we are going to do. We are going to uh, emphasize this fellow and just work them one at a time. things where do I want to use an item or do I want to just try and kind of get through on my own? Uh, okay, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to plop you down and then what I shall do is I will turn relay to V. She can use her secret stash on herself. Get her back to 8 health. You can come over here. Plop you a nice twofer. X, 3 damage. Okay, she 
us two TP back. So then we can kill that one. We can turn relay. She can at least knock this one down again. And then you can turn relay again. And secret stash. Uh, Kabu, because he takes quite a bit of damage. Chomp you. Good. And we can do this. I want to. I want to finish this chapter tonight. Like that's my that's my goal, <laughs> to finish this chapter, <laughs> because I feel like not having really gotten all that far in Monday's stream. I feel like I, I feel like I owe it to myself to make a bit more progress. I feel like I feel like I'm missing something here. Like I see that I see this like crossbar at the top. And I'm like, should I be able to access that? Oh. <laughs> there we go. New sub something had to be here. Sub made by freezing down leaves restores AHP to an ally, but it may cause brain freeze. Um eight HP to an ally, but brain freeze? That's not even good. But at least I know that it was here. That that was the main concern. I was like, there's something here. I don't trust it. What's... Oh, okay. 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 So that's where that goes. So that's actually pretty good. Just heal. So that's probably the purpose of it. But you just... See, I like this design, where everything kind of comes back to the center, and it'll let you um, heal like that, where it doesn't have to put it multiple times throughout. It's just like, yeah, you can go right back to the start and go right back to where you need to go. Like, I think that's really good. It's like it's like uh, it's like Dark Souls level design, where like it always feels nice when you open up like that that passage and you get back to like the bonfire, and you're like, ah, I was here. I know where I am now. Awesome. And it's usually like, okay, cool, now I know how to do a boss run. <laughs> it's why uh, my my ethos for any Souls game is if you know you're going to die and you don't have, like, an absurd, obscene amount of Souls, then you should retreat in a forward direction. <laughs> and by that, I mean, okay, try and find out as much as you possibly can on this life if you know that it's probably going to end unfortunately like run for it and hey maybe you maybe you're really close to a bonfire and you might get lucky or you might find a ladder or you might find like the hidden passage or something you might find something if you just run <laughs> like don't engage with the enemies because you think you might die <laughs> like that that's my that's my ethos with most souls games <laughs> 
Underlick. Leaf, don't try to scare us. That's not Leaf. Ah, <laughs> correct. That's not even how we speak. That's Roach dialect. This place is not for bugs. Leave or be buried! Did, did you need to scream as well? And I mess with taste side a bit ago. I tend to make a dumb idea and just stubbornly stick to it. A really good point. It's generally good enough for an entire backstory. Uh, I mean, hey, man. That's... That's all you need, man. You just need one good spark. You just be like, oh, I want this. And then you can you can just let it go from there. Let your mind wander and craft. Uh, <clears throat> well, yes. <laughs> yeah, just one more war warning on the Eve. Let's get that artifact. Ah. They weren't lying when they said buried. Ah! It's a mummy! A magic mummy! Is that... Is that a roach? It's just a fancy cursed cloth. We can feel it. Its magic is just like ours. Our answers must be here. We won't be stopped by it. Let's go. Yeah, buddy! Shit, I don't have hard mode on. Fuck. Uh, okay. Time to... Time to take a purpose or loss. Well, formidable sorcerer. I can't predict his moves at all. Perhaps because it is truly not... It is not truly alive. Being it will be an act of mercy, and my horn shall deliver victory. Okay, so let's see. Might be good to test to see if I can freeze it. Okay. Okay, so it does another siphon this. Esque move. Okay, have to do that to get out of the ground. But let's turn relay it to leaf, so he can try and frigid coffin it. Okay, no freeze, at least on that attempt. Okay, so I forgot that I was going to purposely take the loss. So I'm just gonna. I'm not gonna block anything. I'm going. I'm gonna do some, uh. Nothing's understrike. What's this? Never. Oh. Oh! Okay, so I need to do it while I'm actually under them. <laughs> Makes sense! Okay, so I can freeze them. And it is for two turns, although. I think hard mode might um, shorten the amount of turns that they're under it. You can do it. Hey, Civilist, how are you doing? Or Sil Silva, Silvalist. How are you doing? Uh, but <laughs> just so you know, I'm going to be taking a lot of purposeful hits because I'm just taking a, I'm taking an L so I can turn on hard mode. That's, <laughs> that's what's happening here. But thank you for the follow. Thanks for being a buddy. Um... But yeah, uh, this is also useful because I can see what the, uh, uh, I can see what, uh, doing good, nice. Uh, I can see what his moves kind of are. Okay, so this one is just putting up a, a wall. Okay. Can you do like an AoE move, please? There you go. <laughs> what? Oh, a buddy. Yeah, you're a buddy. You know what? That means you should get some dabs. Ah. <clears throat> oh, this is perfect. Yeah. So how did uh, how did you come across how did you come across this channel, Silva? Did you just, uh, you just see me in the, like, Bug Fables, uh, game thing? Or did you find me on Twitter? I always like to ask how people found me, because I think it's, I think it's usually an interesting, uh, discrepancy. Because I get, like, a lot of people who join me because like, oh yeah, I really like XYZ game. But some other people recently, I, I found that, they're like, oh yeah, I was just scrolling through Twitter on, on certain hashtags. Okay, there we go. Need 
Load out, metals, turn on hard mode, there we go. Um, detector's fine. Cre I, I could adjust some of my stuff to have it be more, um, more, but I don't really need to. Um, yeah, okay. So that should be good. Got a whole bunch of items. Uh, Discord for me personally. Oh, did you did you find me on the Discord, Fontano? Is that how you found me? 69... Hey, hey, look at his health. Nice. <laughs> uh, okay, so let us... Um, okay, so how do I want to do this? Uh, okay, here's how we're going to do it. We're going to power V. And... Then we're going to turn relay to leaf. I uh, met you through a raid from another streamer, I think. R dub. Ah, uh, yeah, it's R dub. Yep, great guy. Hey, you posted one of your CS2 runs on the server. Yes. Uh, well, live is. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, so now let's come in here. And we twice in the yield. Okay, so hurricane toss. Go. So, how much damage does that one do with an power? It does eight damage. Okay, not bad. So let's see if I can't freeze him. Okay, good. Frozen. Oh, he has a two turn. So I'm gonna actually have do nothing because I want to set it up again. So I'm going to come over here going to honeyed leaf give me five okay six turns poisoned perfect so what I'll do now is I shall hurricane toss eh, 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 eh. there we go went from <laughs> went, went from 61 to 43 that's what I'm talking about and then we are going to try to um, actually, uh, mm, mm, do I want to try and fridge a coffin? No, I don't. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna let the TP core give me some TP so I can do the hurricane thing again next turn. Good. Only took one. There we go, TP core. And now, Mista can go. Not Mista from... JoJo's Bizarre Adventure Golden Wind, or Vento Oreo, but, uh, Mr., as in, a sir. I presume it's a sir. Could be a madam. Never understood the distinction between Miss and Miz. Like, is Miss... Like, is there a distinction? Or is it just a dialect kind of thing? That's always been one, one oddity that I've been curious about. Um... Uh, she doesn't actually have a, a boost. So, you know, I'm going to do a normal attack with her. Four damage, that's damn good. And I'm going to hope that Kabu gets attacked next turn. That way... Um... Ah, oh, damn it. That way they get the empower. Good. Okay. And now, what I can do is I can go for keeps and power her and come in here with another honeyed leaf. Actually, do I? Should I use a honeyed leaf? I could just use a glazed honey. Yeah, it's probably better. You remember any of your D&D &D characters today? Character creation was always one of my favorite parts. I'm stuck on it. Okay, now I will have some fun with the hurricane toss, because this actually ignores one defense while having fun. Okay, good. 13 health already. Gotta love the poison build. Good. Damn it. 
I totally blocked that. Uh, see, I find that I'm blocking, like, I'm tr going for the perfect block and I'm always hitting it too late. I made, I made quite a few. Most of them still in use, though. Had no wizard for quite a while. Nice. Nice. Okay, let's put her in the back. Um, let's put, no, let's put him up front. Um, need to give her a nice leaf omelet. Uh, just to be careful. God, defense f up for four turns. At least it's not four defense up. Um, that would be its own bonkers thing. Oop, okay. Yeah, just take just take the block. Okay. But cool. Luckily, now I can just do a you know I'll do a hurricane toss. Just because I can. And you done, son! You got done did it! And we leveled. Awesome. You're done, son! And I became a mobile nuke. Nice. Uh, three metal points up to 35. Does anyone know what the uh, max amount of metal points is in this game? God. Tell us, how did you get your magic? Who did this to you? Yeah. I'm supposed to just do guessing evocation since you say nuked. Hey, it's a crystal. Curses. Leaf. Hey, look, it's the artifact. Don't despair yet, Leaf. It may hold some answers. Go get it before I do. Huh. This isn't the artifact. Huh? What? And what could it be? Yes, sir. She was an uh, oi, uh, pyromaniac. There we go. I was like, oiromaniac? <laughs> Is that a D&D &D thing? Uh, we don't know, but this doesn't have the same feeling as the others. Maybe it's up ahead? Yeah, look, there's, a, there's not another cloth. Must be a reason this stone is here, though. That's asking you later. For now, we've got to push through. Mm-hmm. Off we go. Yeah, oh, sup, dude? Just coming in from... Yeah, G-Man Locked, always watchful. Hey, look at, th look, at, look at this important story thing. Okay, check behind the statue in case there's anything. Okay. Can't trust games with perspectives like this where I can't turn the camera. It's like if there's a if there's a behind to something, you gotta check it. Merchandise. At last, the final artifact. <laughs> we did it. We're going to the Hall of Fame. It's incredible. You must say, these have been sought after since Elizan's time. It was only through our combined efforts that it was possible. You guys can chat it up later. Let's take it and get that reward. You found the other ancient half. Uh, oh, but uh, I'm not sure if any of you guys saw this uh, on Twitter. Randomly dropping that tomorrow at like, I forget what time, Nintendo's doing a 40 minute direct for games like being released in like the winter. Um, just out of nowhere. <laughs> and I'm like, holy shit! <laughs> Um, and I'm hoping at the end they might drop, like, a release date for Breath of the Wild 2 or some details on it. I'm expecting them to primarily talk about the new Pokemon game, the new uh, SMT game, the other new Pokemon game, Metroid Dread. Um, are there any other big Nintendo titles coming out in the next few months? I don't think so. But, um, yeah, I think that I, uh, I'm, I'm honestly really excited for it. Uh, braving the desert once more, Team Snake Mouth searched for the last artifact. Team explored the road, Trones and uncovered the hideout of the infamous Lost Sand Bandits. An ambush shone a worrying light on Leaf's condition. But in the end, the last artifact was collected. Is the everlasting sapling within reach? End of chapter four. Uh... It's kind of sad, though. I wanted to keep on treasure hunting. Uh, you know what? I'll, I'll put in put in the uh, chapter, it's chapter 5. There we go. Boom. Close. 
Okay, there we go. Still gotta get that sapling. And help leave on his quest. Right, gotta get back to Nia. Let's go turn this in. <laughs> Would you like to save? Uh, I love you, Reginald. You're so good. Then that's the new Diablo 2 game will be ported over. I mean, out, out of all the ports that could probably run on uh, Switch, that could. <laughs> Which is good. Um, not sure if I'll get it. Uh, mostly because I was never too big of a Diablo. Uh, Diablo guy. Um, additionally... Uh, and this is one of those things that I thought was pretty interesting because I saw it, um, I saw it on, um, in, like, an interview with the head of the company making the port, um, where, he, where basically he said, like, due to all the Activision Blizzard stuff with them being absolute, uh, scumbags, he was like, yeah, like, <laughs> he's like, people should only buy it if they feel comfortable, which you normally wouldn't expect out of the president of a company trying to sell a game. <laughs> so, I thought that was pretty cool. Um, oh, dip out for a bit, prepping some stuff for my own stream. Nice! Well, have a nice stream, Tay. What game you playing? I'm guessing some more CS3. Team Snake Mouth! Oh, hello. W what? That. It is unlike you to be so frazzled. Has something happened? The Ant Kingdom is under attack! The wasp is struck! What? You dared to bring the fight to the town? Mathiva and the others are fighting. We've no time for chatter. We some show Minecraft, actually. Add some new shaders installed so it looks pretty. Cool! Never been much, one much for Minecraft. I've never been really able to get into those games that don't have, like, a structured story. Like, I'm not creative enough to think of, like, I'm gonna build something. Or make something. I've always just been like, no, give me a story and I'll do whatever. <laughs> um, but I do like watching other people play it, because I'm like, okay, you know what? This is me watching someone do it, not me actually do it. <laughs> Which is odd that there's a, that kind of distinction. Uh, well, let's go immediately. Let's hurry up, then. Ah. It's good to see the evacuations went well. I'll look for Mathiva. Go check on the queen, and we'll catch up. You're going to fight on your, your own people? Hmm. As if I was anything like those pests. Stay safe. I'm not some damn dirty wasp. Uh, I never thought an invasion would happen. Neither did I, V. But we must fight. We must protect this town that took us in. No time to waste. Let's fri freeze this invasion to a halt. Uh huh. you made a nice pun. Uh, my god, she was a two-by-one tunnel that took about 30 minutes to walk. <laughs> that sounds like... I did something similar to that in, um... Uh... Talk reward. Oh, God damn it! Give me my reward. I did something similar to that in, um, oh, what's that like zombie open world game? Um, uh, Seven Days to Die. Uh, basically, uh, <laughs> I just uh, I had my friend make me like an iron shovel and iron like pickaxe, and I just was like, you know what? There's this mountain separating us from the desert biome where we can get like all the aloe stuff we need. I'm gonna just dig straight through this fucking tunnel. <laughs> straight through this goddamn mountain <laughs> and make a tunnel. <laughs> and that's what I did for like three nights where like me and him were just chatting and he was go doing like off and actually playing the game and I was just in a tunnel, digging away. <laughs> Uh, the time it took to get my card to your game minus uh, Minos Ethel, I may have finished my dirt hut. <laughs> yeah, dude, there's like there's some really crazy like builders out there. Like, like I think it was like, I think it was like the government of like Finland or Norway or something like sponsored people to make like a like a one to one like likeness of it, <laughs> like of the. Uh, of the country. <laughs> Which is pretty crazy. Okay, Spy, what's going on with you? How's the wasp tricking you in problem? I have to walk in and start causing trouble. Okay, I'm gonna teach him a lesson. 
Uh, whoa, he's fast. Okay, focus, but you gotta aim super well if you're gonna win. Can't let him call for more friends. Uh, uh, the alias you set this command to be of... Uh, hashtag Amazon. Not exist. Because Swan and made one on that. Uh, basically, that was a timed thing for this, where uh, if you use that, you can go on Amazon and anything you buy, get a percentage commission on. Um, and I figured I'd just add that as a secondary way of supporting the channel. Uh, but do not feel obligated to use it. It's just there as an option. And that's all it was ever meant to be. <laughs> Uh, okay, so let's do that. But I tried to... Tried to make it, like, be a, a thing. But maybe it, uh... I obviously did it wrong. There we go. Still gonna try and hurt that one the most. Oh, I'm still in hard mode. Damn it. Oh, God. Uh, what if the game took a wild turn and starts saying you deadly hollow knight and he's at you because it meant to, it's meant to be an invasion? I mean, honestly, that would be a pretty cool crossover. Not gonna lie. I'd be all for that. <laughs> I haven't played Hollow Knight. I think at some point in my life I probably will get around to doing that, but um, I just haven't gone around to it myself. My friend just played through it. He really liked it. But it's just not one of those things that I've really like, got myself up to do. Because there are just like a whole bunch of other games that I'm have to play. <laughs> Damn it. You son of bitch. One exploration point. Okay. Excuse me. Hard mode. Okay, so now I, I have three now. So I could put on Triumph Buzz, which is two HP after a battle, which ain't bad. Um, Miracle Matter would be pretty good. Meditation could also be pretty good. Mightier Pebble could be good. But what I think I'm gonna do. I would like to put power exchange on V. So I think, I think, me thinks, what I might do is take off spiky bod. Put on power exchange. Then leave everything on, and then the next time I level and get one, I'll be able to put on TP plus. Because now she's going to be doing one more damage, and the intent will be actually. Uh, see, I w um. okay for right now. What I'll do instead of that. I'll have that I'll have that be my boss strategy kind of deal <laughs> where I'll, I'll do that so I can do more damage with V but just a base I don't want to do that and again we go from out of plant bit me to oh Venus Kabu just got his carapace sliced to ribbons by the mantises and leaf was just eaten by a massive earthworm time to go get our souls back this is my stage how dare you even get near it you dare oppose us don't underestimate him Mataiva I know I don't want to fight you guys. You guys ain't worth my time, little bitches. Hey, how's it going, you guys? 
Save your strength. We'll take care of this. I couldn't protect. Bitch. These guys suck at invading. Ugh, the queen. Rebecca, save them. Okay, am I to presume that this is a boss coming up? Uh, watcher. Uh, oh, that was that thing. The beast? What is this? seem like I'm going to be okay so it doesn't seem like I'm gonna be fighting a boss which is fine god damn it uh 